What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 tutorial, today we are continuing with the simple building system and in today's video we'll go ahead and set up the data table for our build parts. It's going to be a very easy build to follow, so let's get started. Alright, so the first thing we have to do is create a structure which will contain all of the parameters that our uh, data table will contain. So just right click, go into blueprints and create a new structure, this will be S underscore, uh, say build parts. And let's open this up. So our first one will be just name, name of our build. And in this case, this will be a string. And so we just contain some text. Then let's go ahead and add the mesh itself. In this case, this will be a static mesh. Let's go down, static mesh, object reference. There we go. And then we're going to be adding another one. And this will be the uh, basically the blueprint, okay? Which will contain all the logic. So in this case, I'm gonna go and search for actor, and then go down, and in actor, we're gonna go and select as we hover it the class reference because we're gonna be referencing a specific class later on. And then what we're going to do is add a list variable, and this time this will be the layer trace channel. So this is because we're gonna be having different trace to go. Um, different sockets and the sockets will have a different collision and this different trace channel will allow us to uh, pick which build we want to, to choose in this case don't worry about that right now but let's go ahead and just choose the e trace if i know how to type e trace type uh query i think it is uh yeah and then you can see we'll have different trace channels in this case we have two okay so with that we're going to save close and now we can create the data table itself so you right click, go into blueprint, uh, sorry, in blueprint now, it will be in the miscellaneous, which is here. And now we have a whole bunch of things. In this case, we want to do select the data table. So in this case, we're going to uh, pick the structure, which is the uh, build ports. Say okay. And then data table, so DT underscore, and this will be build parts. Once again, let's open this up. And now we can start adding all of our building parts. Just add one. The row name in this case will be, for example, floor. And then again, for the name will be floor. The mesh will be this floor that I have, which I'm using right now. And then the blueprint will right now, I believe I have this uh, BP build floor. There we go. So it's channel right now. I'm going to leave it in visibility. Don't worry about that. And let's add a new one. This will be, for example, just wall. In this case, this will be wall. I search for the wall model over here which will be uh we have two let's pick this one doesn't really matter but i'm gonna pick this one and then here i don't have a blueprint yet so i'm gonna leave it empty now let's add another one and this will be for example the window and this will again we in window and then the model will be window and i can just go ahead and select it will be this one now the blueprint again i don't have one created right now so i'm gonna leave it and it trace around the same so of course you can start adding of your biddable parts that you want into this data table fill in these things of course right now we haven't got to the point of creating other uh, type of uh, blueprints uh, other than the floor so for now keep it like this and but that's it for this tutorial uh, if you found it helpful i would really appreciate if you could like the video and subscribe to my channel remember that the prior files will be available in my patreon and youtube members join my discord server follow me on my socials and now yes with all i said bye bye Bye.